Next thing, with the Chicago Flying Club, if you want to become a member, you have to put your application in at the meeting, like a meeting today. It has to be announced and read at this meeting. If you want to become a member, don't come up to me after the meeting and say, can I apply? Yes, you can, but you've got to show up at another meeting. I have already one application up here. Is there anybody else who's sitting out here who's not a member, who wanted to become a member? Let me know. Raise your hand, and I'll get you an application for it. Great. This is fine. Because we always have a lot of visitors. Everybody has signed in the sheet, I hope. And I think it's time that I introduce the president of the Chicago Coin Club, Elliot Creter. I'd like to call this uh, 1,144th meeting back to order. Um, thank you for all for traveling out here. Um, we've got a few, uh, few minor business things to take care of at first here, and then we'll move on from there. Um, <coughs> Dale, would you like to say a few words about the upcoming a &A? Yes. Uh, welcome, everyone. Um, as most of you know, and if you don't know, um, August 5th to the 9th, in, right across the street at the Donald A. Stevens Convention Center will be the 8 annual convention. Um, it is the largest coin show in this country. Uh, you will find everything and anything there. You are all invited to come. Um, Carl is looking I for can share, volunteers. He'll, he'll, uh, I mean, I have to clean uh, up the draft. Speak on that in a bit. I can share but that also we have a great thing called the, the Money Talks. Yes. Uh, okay. It's formerly called the Numismatic Theater, but it's... Uh, some of the top speakers in the world on numismatics will be there. And if you are one of the top speakers in the world on numismatics and would love to talk, please come and see me because I'm the chairman of the Money Talks. They don't have to be the top speakers. We they don't have to be the top speakers, but uh, <laughs> you, there's a wealth of knowledge in this room. And uh, we would love to have you come and share your knowledge with the rest of the world. Thank you very much. Thank you, Dan. Uh, Carl, would you like to uh, say a few words? And to add, add to what Dale just said, in the logo of the Chicago Coin Club back in the 1930s, one of our members had the foresight to incorporate the Latin phrase, docendo de simus, which means we learn by teaching. So that's what Mark was really referring to when he says, you don't have to be a top speaker. You yourself learn by teaching. All of you probably know more about your specialty than any of us know about your specialty. And we want to hear about it. So please share it with us. But I am at the National Convention. We need about 100 volunteers, or 80 will do also, who will help uh, control crowds here and there, help work the kids zone, help work the a and prize zone. It's not hard work, but we need volunteers. And um, it's impossible for one person to handle it all, but it's all coming in through with these volunteer sheets here. I'll put these at the table in the back of the room. Would you please take one? If you can raise your hand now, I'll pass it out to you. You do not have to be a member of the Chicago Coin Club. A and A would like you to be a member of them, but I'm not, we're not holding you hostage to that right now. I have been promised that if you work four hours in a day, they will give me a parking voucher, free parking voucher for you, if you work four hours that day. That parking voucher is for that ramp across the street, the Rosemont ramp. That's where you have to park. And then if you work four hours, you get a parking voucher. So um, that helps a lot, you know, so that you can then enjoy the rest of the show and work four hours a day every day. I have a number of people who are willing to do that. Did I cover everything, Dale? Sure. Oh, well, we're hoping we'll probably have golf shirts for everybody to wear. And we're asking for the size here, too, uh, so that you guys stand out on the floor. In 2011, we were a turquoise blue. 2013, it was a beautiful, uh, vivid jade green. I'm not sure what it would be this year yet. Oh, oh, there we go! <laughs> <laughs> this is the Philadelphia, the red. Right, the red, the red. But, uh, but anyway, you will get a new shirt on that. Hopefully, everybody comes through on that. Any questions from this? Great. I'm going to put these in the back here. Uh, do grab one, fill it out. Uh, we'd appreciate it. Thank you very much, Carl. <coughs> so without further ado, I'll introduce my first vice president, Rich Lippin, who will introduce our featured speaker. So I'm going to put in a little ad hoc plug also here for the PAGE program uh, at the ANA. So some of you are aware, some of you are not, but uh, teenagers, and the age does vary a little bit year to year, so you have to kind of look on the ANA website. Uh, I call it volunteer with benefits. So they work essentially running around for dealers, uh, doing errands of various sorts, giving out flyers, getting food, and so on. And although they don't get paid, they get tipped. And they get tipped often very substantially. Uh, so, iPods, 
and iPads have come out of this experience. They can, uh, they can uh, do it on a daily basis or they can do it for a few days during the meeting uh, and so on as well. The sign up is on the a and website. You actually sign up through the a and even though the club kind of manages it, manages it on site. So if your teenager is around, around the beginning of August and they want to pick up some substantial spare change usually, uh, it's an opportunity you might want to mention to them. <laughs>